Hey B-Squad, I'm starting off this new vlog pretty strong in my new car. I got a new car and this is what it's looking like. I guess this is my Christmas gift to myself. Today is December 20th. Um, I got a little thing for it. Got a new radio. Got a phone um, holder. So it's looking really, really cute. And yeah, I'm super duper excited to drive it. I may have to drive it to work tomorrow. It's really, really clean and I got it for a great price. So yeah, I don't have to bother mommy anymore for her to bring me to work early, 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 early in the morning or late, late, late at night. So I'm very proud of myself. She's very proud of me as well. I'm gonna keep getting some more stuff for the car, but this is what it's looking like. I'm so proud of it. Yeah. <laughs> so prepare to see me in this bad boy more often. Um, I paid for it um, with cash, so I don't have any car payments at all. I paid off my insurance as well. And I got my registration and fitness. I mean, you know, obviously I'd have to have that part. But yeah, I'm just testing out because I, I didn't test out the heat. So I'm going to actually turn it down now. So maybe you guys can hear me better. Uh, I'm just so proud of it because like I said, I don't have any recurring car payments. Um, and yeah, I have bought some seats seat covers on Amazon but then when I went and looked back at a picture of them it them just did ugly so I was like cancel immediately so yeah that cancel because I bought it at the same time that I got this uh, thing to hold my phone and I'm so proud I'm so happy next thing is a house that I want to buy but I am still looking for an apartment to rent but we definitely want to buy a house next um, I don't know if I want to buy a house in New York or some other state. So I really need to start like creating a plan for that. But I do want to rent somewhere in New York. Anywho, I just wanted to share that. I will see you guys probably later tonight or tomorrow. I got assigned 2 a.m. to 2 p.m. And I'm good for like six days. So I definitely think they're going to use me. Uh, so you will see me somewhere. Hopefully somewhere warm or somewhere far and when i mean far i mean on another continent okay and when i mean somewhere warm i mean an island okay let's ask specifically for what we want i also went to the gym and i've been going to the gym these past three days so i'm not waiting for january to start accomplishing my goals i can't wait for january i said i gotta start going to gym january because no, my nap was off. I felt so bad and now I'm starting to feel a little bit more better and more, you know, proud of myself for going to the gym and doing a full workout and not being distracted. So anyways, like I said, my rumble. Thank you guys so much. A lot of you guys already saw on Instagram that I got this car and I may drop a post um on my YouTube community page. But I really appreciate all the love and support. I'm genuinely here because of a lot of you guys have really showed so much support. Showered, showered me with prayers and love and I truly appreciate it. Let me turn on the light in the car. Light the light in the car don't work. Um, oh, but I look so washed out. Anywho, bye. Good morning, good morning. So I want to show you guys this lens, this wide angle lens that I bought. Oh my gosh. Like it was, how much was it? 
$48.23 and the quality is extremely amazing it's from the brand called newer so when I saw the brand I was like oh I know they got like a lot of ring lights they got a lot of other amazing quality stuff so I was like okay let me just get it from them girl I did not do my due diligence I did not read the comments but like I said the quality is super duper amazing but I need to get an adapter because this part, the the back, sorry, because I don't know why, the back part that would go attached to my lens, I need an adapter for it. But when I tell you that this is actually really beautiful, like it's super duper beautiful, like you don't even understand. But the next thing, it's fish eye. It's fish eye. So I don't know. It's fish eye. So and I don't like fish eye stuff like that. I'm gonna put it over so you can kind of see, but I have to hold on to it. Let me try to move so you can see. It's a fish eye. It's super wide angle because look, y'all see that. I know you see that. Super wide angle, like that is so amazing look how wide angle it is but it's a fish eye and I don't like that so I'm gonna take off the second part because it comes as two in one and macro should mean big right because micro is small so maybe it's not maybe it's not um maybe it's not I don't know I'm gonna just have to figure out a way to make it work like I'm, I'm gonna have to get creative cuz I'm not gonna waste my money I'm not gonna send it back cuz the quality is amazing so hopefully this one is a wide angle and it ain't oh I'm so disappointed oh my god wasted my money I'm so upset this one okay macro is small macro is tiny so what is micro there's no way because I thought <sighs> large scale so am I did I miss something should I turn it the other way let's see oh you are tripping beyond belief because <laughs> that did not fit at all it was so huge compared to the lens yeah so i messed up so sorry i'm testing you guys out just let me know what y'all think this supposed to be micro so when i do like uh oh my fault okay hold on sorry about that let me find something that i want to show you okay boom this is super cute here we go again it's not even the best is my light on <laughs> Okay, hold on. Bear with me. I don't know why I didn't turn the actual room light, the window. I mean, I guess. This will this will be nice. But the fisheye, I'm still... I don't... I low-key want to cry because it's like it's such a great quality like when I tell you this feels okay maybe maybe hear me out hear me out maybe it's a, it's a fish eye I got I got scam I didn't get scammed but do y'all like this fish eye look can I vlog with this sometimes I don't know because when I watch some vlogs with a fish eye it annoys the living daylight out of me let me know what y'all think if I ever did a vlog. I'm looking a little bit crazy, but if I ever did a vlog like this. Hey guys, welcome to the vlog. Let me know. Do y'all like it? I think I'm kind of liking it with good lighting. This is going to be the difference. Let me know. I'm willing to do a whole vlog just to see if you guys like it. Moral of the story. Read. <laughs> Good morning B squad. So today we're heading from JFK to Barbados and I've never been to Barbados before. I'm so so excited. I actually 
went on my Instagram and asked you guys to leave some recommendations of you know what are some things to do in Barbados at nighttime and a lot of you guys left some recommendations that I'm really excited to try out not only that but one of my managers is from Barbados uh, so I asked her some good stuff you know and she gave me some recommendations as well so I'm super duper excited I will see you guys on the plane let's head to Miami I finished all of my pre-flights put up the suitcase and everything um, so now I just chill if y'all watch some of my older flight attendant videos then you know my position before I did what I had to do I got one more thing to do and that's really it for me and then I'm just gonna help with boarding but make sure you like comment share subscribe and like I said I'll see you in Barbados or actually I'll see you in Miami and then I'll see you in Barbados All right, guys, we're in Barbados. Barbados! Ah! <laughs> Make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you when we get to the hotel. All right, hey, B-Squad. We are in our hotel room. I'm gonna do a real quick tour. This is the bathroom, and that's me, your lovely host for the day. Uh, we have a shower, toilet, and a bathtub, which is either or. We never have shower and a bathtub so that's very different right in this closet we do have the very usual and typical items aka the iron board and your iron you also have your safe and extra storage so y'all already know that's what we normally have then we have our little mini fridge area very well hidden and our little bar tea area to my right is a full body mirror, which you know the girlies love. <laughs> Me, I'm the girlies. And then we have the bedroom. It's very nice. I really like the, the uh, rug that they have. And then obviously we have our two side tables. I should have turned on this light, but please bear with me. Then we do have a TV. Y'all know I don't really ever turn on a TV. They did give us two waters. Thank y'all. And we have an extra seating area right by the bed. And my favorite part, because I cannot wait until the morning time. I can't wait until the morning. I can't wait until the morning. <laughs> You're not going to see it that well. This lens is not the best at low light stuff. But we do have a lighthouse immediately. Immediately in front of our balcony. And it's a pretty big balcony. I know the camera doesn't do the best job at showing you guys like how big everything is, but it is super duper amazing. And then you can see the courtyard. The pool is to the right. And oh, the beach. I cannot wait for tomorrow. The beach. But again, the balcony. The drone shots are going to go so hard. I will try my best to take some drone shots tonight. I mean, you guys have probably seen that already. But I was going to go to Oysins. And you know what? I was going to go to Barcelona. Not Barcelona. I was going to go to Argentina next month. And I think, I think not. I think I will be back in Barbados tomorrow. My camera is getting super duper foggy. So please bear with me. But yeah, this is the rest of the room tour. And if I can come to Barbados for even four nights next month, I will be there. So I don't, I don't think I'm gonna go to Argentina. Drop a comment down below. Where do you think I should go? Should I go to Argentina or should I go to Barcelona? At this point, I've already been because it's quite literally two weeks away. And I'm just so excited. I'm so, 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 so excited. This is the rest of the, the room. Make sure you like again, comment and subscribe if you haven't already. But yeah, I'm gonna go get ready and meet my crew members. I quite literally have five minutes to meet them, but I will be there on my own time. They knew what they were getting into when they invited me out. But I won't be getting to go to um Oystens. Let me flip this camera real quick. Well, let me get on ready and tell you guys the honest to god truth. I was gonna go by myself 
to either Lawrence Gap, The Gap, St. Lawrence Gap, whatever you want to call it. Or I was going to go to Oyston's. Um, I asked when I got here, I asked one of the people down by the lobby, hey, like, you know, how much is a taxi to Oyston's? And he said, 50, I think like 50 some Bayesian don't know the currency as of yet Bayesian dollars and he was like that's about 24 27 uh usd so i was like mm, it's kind of steep so i was like how much is our regular taxi because i don't want nobody price me up just because my dad's some expensive hotel that i'm not paying for so how much is a regular taxi and then he said, um, you know, like they're probably going to charge you up as well because you're walking around in that area where it is very expensive. So I think that is very expensive. You're walking around at nighttime, couple blocks away, they're still going to overprice you. They're still going to charge you a lot. So my crew members weren't really interested in going and seeing the nightlife. I'm still going to get up super duper early in the morning because I really want to see the area. I'm not the kind of person that I think you guys noticed from now. I'm not the kind of person that just stay in a resort when i was even in curacao i did have to stay relatively close to the hotel but i did not stay in the in the hotel itself like i need to explore i need to see what i want i need to see other things you know thing and thing so yeah so tomorrow i'm gonna walk i'm very devastated though because i really wanted to see what the nightlife in barbados would look like especially being that what's today the 22nd of December. I know Christmas would have been nice. Like I know like this this right now would have been nice because in Jamaica, Grand Market and them thing day, granted it's on the 24th, but the energy, the festivity, the liveliness is going on. So I'm I'm actually really sad. I just I love my crew. I think they're so nice. Great girls, like the pilot and the the captain. The captain and the first officer are very, very funny, very, very nice. Um, the chivalry did not, did not stop at their feet. They got, they're very. Is is there? So, I'm just sad though that. They didn't want to go explore um, Beijing nightlife. Um, so I'm going to have to do that myself. Hence why I may not go to Argentina next month and I may come to Barbados. So I'm talking way too much. I'll see you guys in, in um, a couple minutes. In a couple seconds. Bye. It's probably super late. My crew members are probably down there having a great time. But I had to get real cute and comfortable, so I'm going to meet my crew members. And this is my little outfit. I do have a swimsuit on just in case I do change my mind and I want to go to the jacuzzi by myself. But it is almost midnight, as you can see. At least in Barbados. In New York, it is currently 10.39. This song, this song is, I've known this song for a couple good months but check out my um i don't know which which floor is actually the right floor check out my spotify because this song right here i've had it on repeat vibes cartel whiskey and thames essence just j edit make sure y'all check it out Okay, so I tried some of their local rum. I'm going to try and get an overshot of what it looks like, but I'm going to my drinks for now. So. Ready? load from in the Ready to grab a stink like a leg at a pan. Whiskey, crack, who the we are the weatherman. A boy should have drop, but the very better jam. Long time we no kill a man So we circle them in that the a man mm. Set a bomb, make a jam Top train far, so we must catch a man That's the eta with the girl I had a great night 
to say the least. A very good, a very good night. That I woke up at 9 a.m. Two hours after the time I was originally supposed to wake up and walk to Rihanna Drive. So, it's safe to say I'm not going to walk to Rihanna Drive today. But, I will be coming back to Barbados um, next month. I think I had a great time. I'm going to tell Kai. I'm going to tell my other friends. And... I'm going to save Argentina for another time. And I will be coming back to Barbados. Uh, it was it was it was a great night. So what I'm going to do now is get ready. I'm going to see where the closest KFC is cuz I'm also super duper hungry. Even though I have food on me and I should be warming up the food I brought, we're going to try out Bayesian KFC. So, let's go. Alright, I changed into my Jamaica top. Kept on the same shorts and same flip flops. And y'all know when I'm in the next country, I'm wearing my Jamaica top. So, I gotta do it. <laughs> I gotta represent. I gotta let people know. Anywho. Let's head into town, at least the gap, and get some KFC together. Well, the ATM ate my card, so no cash for me and i just lost a card that i just got literally last month at this point my bank is going to be like we can't trust you to keep a card it keeps this keeps happening to me and i i may just cry because i'm actually hungry all right i have to be really quick i'm just gonna have this instead which this is what I should have done in the beginning. I was just talking to Kai. My two hunger belly. I, wa I wanted that KFC so bad. But now I'm out of a card. And it's not even like a weekday. It's Saturday. So basically I'm never seeing that card again. I already ordered a replacement card. <sighs> the fruits are so refreshing. Mm. Time for me to leave Barbados. I'm all dressed. I'm wearing my heels more often now and I'm wearing my red lipstick a lot more often. Suitcase is packed up. One last look at the beautiful view from my balcony. And I'll see you guys on the, in the van. It's so steamy. So, so steamy. But we're leaving. <laughs> Thank you. 
Welcome to my Costa Rican hotel. So I'm gonna start off real quick by showing you a real fast hotel room tour. So when we step in, this is what we're greeted by seeing. To the left is the toilet room, quite literally just that. And then to the right, you see a bathtub in the middle of the room, then a bed and a pull-out um, sofa bed. Then you'll also see um sorry see closets with your hangers, ironing board, extra pillowcases, blankets, iron, etc. etc. and a full body mirror. In fact, hi. <laughs> uh yeah. So then when you come around this little corner that you're greeted with, you see your double vanity and your walk-in shower. So let me show you that real quick right here with the rainfall shower and the handheld one which is really nice now back to the room it's a very purple room i don't know this is the rio in costa rica i don't know how much reels they have but this is the rio in costa rica it's very purple i've never seen a hotel room so purple it's not ugly or anything but it's it's an interesting taste they do um, have some hibiscuses on the bed, which I think is really, really beautiful. And they have a blanket um, shaped like a swan with a hibiscus. So the creativity is definitely there compared to a lot of other hotels. Now I'm going to show you my view and then I'm going to get changed to meet my crew members. This is an all-inclusive hotel, including the mini fridge, like be for real. It's absolutely amazing. So let's go outside. Let me first figure out how to open the door. Okay, hold on, because this always happens to me. This always happens to me. <laughs> I'll be right back so I can show you the view of outside. We are outside. The pool is right over there. I was really looking for something super duper duper hot so I can get a tan. So I'm really hoping that tomorrow's weather is much better than today because it was raining a little bit but they do have an all-white party tonight so i'm very interested to see what that's gonna look like i don't have anything white in my suitcase but i'm ready to show up as a person in all black the pool does look really nice and a swim out and it's all inclusive i said i was gonna start my dry january now but what's two more days right <laughs> It's not January 1st yet, so I can, I can splurge. I can splurge. Just had a little bit of appetizers with my crew and we're down by the pool. Well, before you get to the pool. <gasps> what is that? Someone's beads bursted on my head. But anyways, it's so beautiful. Is that a baby crown? Yeah. Huh? Look at the sky, it looks pink. You see that? Mm -hmm. <coughs> it's a cotton candy. Yeah. It's really pretty. The strawberry back. Have any of you ever had a French 75? Like it's some type of cocktail. So music is playing and I don't want to get demonetized. We're now at the Japanese restaurant and we're gonna try some specialty Japanese food. Got my chopsticks. You guys know I love using chopsticks.
Good morning, guys. We are headed to the gym. The gym at this resort is 6 a.m. to 8 p.m. So to my surprise last night, when I went at nine, the gym was closed. So I was like, huh? I was in full shock. I was like, what? I have not been to a gym ever in a hotel that's not 24 seven. So I was like, you close the gym at eight? I was shocked. So we're heading to the gym now. I'm only gonna spend 30 minutes to an hour because it's a little after six. I woke up an hour ago and I really hope the weather is nice today because I want to head to the beach, you know me, and maybe get some drone shots. So I'm gonna head up to the gym. Also, I was freezing in the room last night so I had to wake up, turn off the AC, and open this a bit. So now I can hear the little animals. I don't know what kind of animal it is, birds, whatever. Singing songs. Again, this is my view. And it's just so beautiful. I really love it. Can you imagine a time when this place was untouched by man? Like just natural like nature all the way down to the beach like you stumble up on a lost island well it's not an island but a lost country with a beautiful beach i need to go see the beach for one so you know what let me stop talking let's go to the gym on the beach so maybe I, I didn't see I saw a tent when I yeah, there's a tent that was just one point to kind of go Hope you enjoyed those drone shots. I'm gonna, where's my phone? <laughs> I'm gonna lay by the pool for the next 30 minutes and um, get a nice little tan. I have a collection going. So I really wanna, I really wanna get a nice one. The sun is out. Yesterday when we came, it was, um, it was what was it cloudy and it was raining a little bit but now we have a great amount of time the pickup time is 11 a.m and it's 9 22 so i will see you guys when i'm all packed and ready to go bye Feel like this. Only been days, but it feel like months.